Welcome to part three of the analysis of SAN, which IB provides as an example that scored 10 out of 10. We've already analyzed the introduction and the first body paragraphs. This will take you through to the end. In this paragraph on natural sciences, the student really weaves together the real life situation and the TOK concepts. It's very um, embedded with each other. Um, but with this planner, I tease them out and kind of show you how the real life situation is certainly not just described, but analyzed with TOK concepts. So they are talking about how true scientific purpose can be corrupted. And if you try to look at natural science in a vacuum, you could see there are those that study science just to solve problems. But in the real world, there's these obligations to create money. And those corrupt, these obligations corrupt the original intent to solve problems, such as curing a disease. Um, you might have the cure, but the obligation stops you from curing the disease. And their real life situation is Ebola, and the cure has been created, yet thousands in West Africa still die because they don't have access to the medicine. So this shows that society rewards those who found the cure financially instead of curing the sick, which would be the original purpose and meaning of the pursuit of knowledge. So an excellent counterclaim. So this next paragraph jumps to a different AOK, to math, which is uh, unusual. Usually if you write a claim in one AOK, you write the counterclaim in the same AOK. Uh, now this essay is addressing a prescribed title that doesn't mention two AOK explicitly. Many do, so that's one reason for the freedom here. And the other reason is this one's operating at a very high level and when you're writing very well and making good logical conclusions it earns you some freedom. Um, so the concept here is quite simple that math is very abstract and it's very intellectually rigorous and if you wish to study math then you need to really love math and that's your purpose and your meaning. So they draw a line between businessmen and economists who might use math, but they're not studying pure math. And they say that if you're studying as a pure academic mathematician, then you're going to be very connected to meaning and purpose, which is an interesting point. So in this final uh, body paragraph, the student explores their own journey through multiple AOK -OK and how a personal experience gave them meaning and purpose. So a very creative idea. This is actually the fifth body paragraph, so I copy and pasted the part of the planner to create space for it, as you can do if you're a student and you want to write a fifth body paragraph. So their personal experience was their trip to Eritrea, which is their homeland. It implies a connection to um, culture that they don't, they don't say, but it's very clearly in there and also this idea of progress that their desire to improve the world motivates them um, and then they talk about how it led them to study their math, led them to study things in their humanities, in their Spanish, in their EE and created this overall purpose in their life, this personal experience that crossed multiple uh, AOK. -okay. So a really sophisticated final paragraph addressing meaning and purpose. Okay, and now we're at the conclusion. So uh, you've read over it, and you can see that it's a very solid, strong conclusion. It restates some of the main, main points and ends with a wonderful point about how original purpose can be subconsciously subverted by societal pressures and desire for success, and they, say they worry about their own being possibly influenced by the, themselves which is a very personal and really strong way to end it. If we look at the rubric, you can see clearly this essay has been sophisticated and insightful and compelling throughout. All right, so here we are at the end. Congratulations, you've made it 
the entire way through a level 10 essay. This essay does a very good job of incorporating lots of TOK concepts, but every essay is different. Some focus on ways of knowing, some focus on lots of theories within an AOK or ideologies or methodologies, but in somehow you have to focus on ideas. The more detail that you put into this TOK concepts box, the earlier you show your teacher, the more feedback you can get on it and the higher your grade will go. So really this box is your friend. Enjoy your thinking and happy trails.